a women voter member from Teton County. Welcome to the third of four candidate forums that are being co-sponsored and organized by local league members, by the Teton County Library and media representatives, including the Jackson Hole News and Guide, KHOL Community Radio, Planet Jackson Hole, Wild File and NPR. Did I miss anybody? I hope not. Um, let us know if you're interested in helping the next time we do this, because we're always looking for some recruits to bring this kind of good, solid, face-to-face -face information to members of the community about the people that they are interviewing to represent them in government. Um, other introductions I'd like to make, we have Melissa Cassett and uh, Rebecca Huntington, who will be helping in this early segment um, with as questioners. Uh, Virginia, where did you go? There's Virginia Adler. She'll help. There, we're going to be doing musical chairs, and she's going to help a little bit later with um, fielding three by five cards from the audience so that you can send those questions up to the table. And we will be doing our best to allow for audience questions either through the three by five cards or up at the mic. And I'll just try to keep that circulating um, so that there's opportunity for all questions to be heard. And the candidates tonight, we're, we're going to begin with Mike Guru and Andy Schwartz who are not having con big contests. <laughs> I'm revising the way I'm saying that because I just got some new information. Would you gentlemen come up? And we're, um, we will begin by asking Mike, who is a candidate for District 16 state representative to make a two minute statement about himself and his candidacy, and then we'll move on to Andy, and then I'll give you a little bit more information about the rest of the evening. Thank you. Oh, I should also, um, and Sava, I'm sorry, I already forgot, uh, introduce Karen Jerger, who is our timer, who has prompts for you when you have time left or need to wrap it up. <laughs> okay, all set? Yep. Uh, good evening. Um, thank you to Lee uh, and all of you for being here. My name is Mike Guru, and I'm running for the Wyoming House of Representatives District 16. And I could probably spend the whole two minutes just describing that district, but suffice it to say that on November 8th, if you go into the voting booth and you see my name, I'd appreciate your vote for House District 16. If you don't see my name, your good thoughts would be great. Um, I just have a couple of minutes, and we do want to save time for contested races, and I, like I say, I appreciate that. But what I wanted to talk about in my couple of minutes is just the importance of what happens 13 days from now. 13 days from now is, to me, Christmas, my birthday, all the greatest days all rolled into one. My family thinks it's absolutely bizarre, but I honestly believe that. To me, election day is the greatest day in our country. Because on that day, at that moment in time, the most important person in the world is in this room. More important than the President of the United States, more power than the leaders of the, uh, the Supreme Court, more, more, more important than any legislator, anyone, that is in our country, and that's you and me. On that day, we're all the same. Your power is equal to and no less than the President of the United States or anyone that you'll hear up here. And that's the wonder of it. That's the wonder of our system. That's what makes this the greatest country in the world, and that's what makes us the most proud, makes me the most proud to be a citizen of this country and makes me want to serve. I've had the honor of serving as a town councilman uh, for four years in this town, county commissioner in this county for six years, and I look forward to serving you in the Wyoming legislature from House District 16. I appreciate your vote. 
But more importantly, tell your friends, make sure that you get out and vote. It's the most important thing we do. Thank you very much. Thank you, buddy. Wow, I don't know quite how to follow that. Um, I'm Andy Schwartz. I am currently representing some of you, at least, in House District 23, and I'm running again. Um, my opponent is not here tonight. Um, I'm not going to talk about voting. I think I can't say it any better than Mike did, but I will talk a little bit about Wyoming. Um, as many of you know, for many years, we had a lot of money because when the energy industry is going well, we have money. And when the energy industry doesn't do as well, we don't have as much money. And we are now in one of those bust moments. It um, changes things dramatically in Cheyenne. But there actually is something that you all can do to help that this year. Because on the ballot, in addition to all of the other things, there is a constitutional amendment. It's Constitutional Amendment A, and as our beloved state treasurer says, vote yay for A, because what that will do is allow us to invest more of our reserves in equities and other forms of investment that will get us a better return on the dollar. And right now, when we're only getting 1%, inflation may basically says we're losing money on all of the money we saved, and that's really not wise policy. So I encourage you to vote yay for A. And then after that, if you also vote for me, that would be greatly appreciated. Um, I'm told I only have 30 seconds, and the only other thing I think is really important is to remember that Teton County is part of Wyoming. <laughs> and, and we forget that a lot of the time, but it's, it's, it, and it's some extent it's reciprocated, but we have to get over that and remember, we are part of the wonderful state of Wyoming. And sometimes you guys should come down to Cheyenne and check out what we do down there. So thank you all for coming and I hope you look like people that will vote, but do please vote. And thank you to the league and to the reporters. Thank you both. We appreciate you being here. We're going to take about one.